was never able to hit 3 million XP with this build, but got 2.8 in one hour, which is pretty incredible. Good morning, Diablos. Welcome back to the channel. We're going to go over the build real quick that is getting the job done to easily get 2 to 2.5 million XP per hour. First, on your main hand, you're going to need the runic ally circle. <laughs> so that so your mystic allies just keep attacking. It's going to be all about ground damage. For the shoulders, you're going to have the echoing bell. That's going to inflict continuous damage for about 5 seconds. And on the chest piece, we have the tornado, which is becoming my favorite. And quick preview for the future fam. This set right here is going to make you one of the highest damage in the game. I'm not sure if we're ever going to pass up Demon Hunters, but I am certain once we get the 4 piece on this, we're about to pass everybody else up. Now for the pants, Mystic Allies, an extra 3 seconds. That is helpful for keeping the chain going, and if... If you're like me and you get lost on the map sometimes, your mystic allies will run towards the nearest mob and that'll keep it going. So let's see these moves in action. So I did forget to mention, this is going to be running Elder Rifts. I keep calling them Greater Rifts, but they are called Elder Rifts. And the goal is to get them done in under 3 minutes. They give about 120 to 160k XP each. So hypothetically, under the best case scenario, you should be able to get over 3 million an hour, which I have not been able to. All we're doing here is we're constantly cycling out our moves and moving, basically. If you would like to, feel free to own the champion packs. And if you really want to try to increase your legendary drop rate, I would own the yellow mobs as well. They could slow your time down a bit, though because you will have to burst them down. They have about 80k right now, so you would need to use possibly two or even three of your moves. Movement speed would be a huge plus here. We do not have any movement speed increasing items at this time, but I think that could be... That would be what would... Oh, we almost lost the chain. <laughs> uh, oh, we're still keeping it going. But that would be the key to potentially... 2 minutes and 30 seconds. So, just cycling them out. Drop this champion pack. Keep on moving. About 80% of the way there. I think we are 2 minutes in. So we need to hustle. You do want to save your mystic allies for the boss. You don't want to you don't want to fight the Guardian without your Mystic Allies. It really slows things down. I cannot wait to see if that 4-piece, though, will make it. So we do not need the Allies. Every 4 attacks is going to be bonus damage on 3 different moves. So the Tornado and the Mist and the, the Runic Circle are going to be dealing with massive damage. Now, if you're lucky, and you're, we're not going to be able to get to it, but if you're ever lucky and you can get to it fast enough... You can throw the Rift Guardian in the chain. It rarely happens, but it'll increase your XP by a base amount of around 12k. It's worth trying. And we're gonna drop this boss. Get him down. Very important now. Once you pick everything up, we're gonna pick everything up, get our XP. Now teleport out. You don't want to wait on that teleport. You got to save all the precious seconds you can. I thank you all for watching. I hope you all have a great day. Eat some good food. And above all else, smash.